And just like that, we're back on Sister Circle Live and we're joined by two of the most instrumental people in my competition prep process. You've seen this guy here a few times before. He's an IFBB Classic Ooh. Physique Pro competitor and my prep coach, Katie Wilson. And making her Sister Circle Live debut is my posing coach. Oh, yes. 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 yes! Figure Pro, Ashley Sparks. I'm so glad that both of you are here yes. today. Yes. Now, I came down from 236 pounds. Yes. By the time I hit the stage, I was a smooth, in Rashawn's words, about 179. Mm -hmm. uh, what was the, I brought my, I brought my scale, so I know. What was the strategy you implemented to kickstart my weight loss? Okay, then, and tone me up for the competition stage. So basically, from beginning to end, because I wasn't like 12 week prep. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. it was a little different. Um, so kind of how Rashawn talked on, we broke it up in small goals so the mm -hmm. first one was the album mm -hmm. and um when she she talked about it, she was like maybe i want to do a show when she first reached out but i want to focus on the album first so i said well that's our first goal it wasn't a necessarily a number amount but we want to look good for pictures mm -hmm. um then after that she was like okay i look pretty good now we can kind of gear it up um so then we were slowly just trying to get to a manageable weight so we can actually start a prep mm -hmm. then we went to africa and uh we had some other Challenges. Obstacles come up. Um, <laughs> yes. So it's really, it was just trying to steadily lose, not a fast weight loss, um, but at the same time fight through all the obstacles that we, we had come to, uh, mm -hmm. to fruition. So it was small goal, though. That's the easy way to do it. If I tell her from the jump at 2.36, say, hey, we got to lose 75 pounds. That's intimidating. Yeah, that is. But if I say we got to lose 10 pounds here, or get stronger here, it's a lot more tangible mm -hmm. to make it happen. So mm -hmm. yeah. I agree that with was that. a whole strategy. Yeah, that's so, good. So Ashley, what was your motivation in becoming a fitness competitor and what were some of the barriers that you had to break through and to be accepted as an African American woman in that sport? Mm. Right. Actually, I started as a bikini competitor okay. back in 2014 is okay. when mm -hmm. I actually did my first show. Um, after that show, I was really, really small and I was like, I really want to lift weight. I want some muscles. Um, so that's actually when I started shaping my body and molding my body to become a figure competitor. And mm -hmm. those barriers, talk to me about the bar barriers that you had to break. Right, so you have, just like Selena um, spoke about, as far as your diet, as far as cardio, um, sacrifice. Sacrifice, staying consistent is the really big factor in it. Being consistent and lifting, eating, and also finding that balance. Mm -hmm. Most competitors, it's hard to find balance because you have a life outside of yeah. competing. So she's a mom, and so it's really, really, uh, I would say that would be the bearers is finding balance. But, yeah. but I think what Quad was asking too was like, to be black women, yeah. when you're on stage and when you're in the, because I experienced some interesting things we can talk about later, child. Mm. But as a black woman, woman in this sport, what are some of the things that you come up against yeah. because of being a black woman, our physique, you know, like our legs and stuff like that? Right, so um, as a black woman, the we have problems with our legs and our glutes. That's one of the two main problems? factors. What's problem, um, what's as problem? far as coming down, <laughs> we mm. hold a lot of fat in that area or we may hold a lot of muscle in that mm. area. Yeah. Um, so it's actually hard to come down. Upper body, we can do that all day. That's the easy part. So. It's just actually staying consistent with the cardio and actually high intensity training to make sure you you can you know mold those mold your legs mm -hmm. into the the way they need to be and also symmetry. It's not a weight loss contest. Mm -hmm. It's all about symmetry. Your upper body has to match your lower body. Your glutes, everything has to align together, and that's the part that takes the longest. Well, Coach Katie, um, Selena was in the figure category in our Correct. competition. Yep. So what does what does that mean? What does it so, entail? How do you a lot of times when you can see <laughs> on the, oh, yeah, you can see on the post, people like, oh, she's bodybuilding. So it's many different categories on the bodybuilding. You got bikini, which is the smaller, kind of more petite girls. Figure is a small waist, a nice V taper, a nice wide back, which she has naturally. Mm -hmm. So yeah. now we're just kind of bringing it down to kind of sculpt it to what it is. Then you have physique. Those are the women that kind of pose kind of like I do, women's physique, and then you have women bodybuilding, which is the biggest, they have a lot of muscle. Um, so those are the four different categories. Oh, that's good, that's yeah. good. And posing, Ashley, how important is 
posing because you she had a whole coach to do learn how to do that. <laughs> but it's a thing though. Yes. Talk to us about that. And that's actually one of the hardest parts. Surely. So you would need to give yourself eight weeks, sometimes longer. Just depends on how fast that your body and you can able to practice and adapt to that. Um, it definitely takes some time for that. Wow. Yeah. Well, I that know you want to publicly give them thanks well, again. Well, I just want to say, without you guys, I could not have done this. I'm, I love you. I thank you so much. I can't wait to do the second one. Yeah. Well, my next one. Yeah, how about I say the second? Uh huh. Um, and I just want everybody to uh, follow them. They're also trainers, and they also train people uh, virally as well. Yes. So, yes. Um, what are we saying here? We just keeping in speed, okay? Yes. And to keep up with all things Coach KD, including how you can kickstart your incredible body transformation with him, go to his Instagram page, KD with the Muscle, and to follow uh, Ashley, you go to at Twixie Babies.